I'm Shona and I started Shonaquip because of my own personal experiences with one of my daughters who was born with severe disabilities and the doctors told me to put her in a home and have another baby and it sort of really shocked us and made me angry and I wanted to prove that kids, no matter what their abilities, have a really important part to play in your family and should be valued. Through my own experiences, I started realizing that if my daughter was not correctly seated, she wouldn't be able to engage to communicate. How do you create good alignment 24 hours a day, not just in sitting, but in standing and lying? So Shonequip creates alternative positioning devices. So they came to Stanford and asked us to design a new side positioner. The Lala 2 is a positioning device help to prevent spinal deviations. And it also helps the joints to maintain a good amount of range. Currently, the side positioners that we see in care centers are really difficult for the carers to use. So we wanted to redesign a new side positioner that was not just easy for the caregivers to use, but really delightful for the child and the carer to interact with. Because this is not a therapeutic intervention only, it's a lifestyle. Shonequip has a very holistic approach to creating an inclusive world. So we have therapists, designers, manufacturers. So this iterative process works really well with the Stanford design process where it's all about user-centric and iterative design. We've seen the kids in different iterations of these prototypes, but just recently we have finished our first batch of 20 devices and it's been incredibly rewarding to see the kids in these devices, to see the carers interact with it and tell us that it's easy to use. That aha moment that uh, we knew that we were onto something was when the kids would fall asleep in the position while we were interviewing the caregivers. The end product, the LALA 2, it really can exist in this unique ecosystem that children with disabilities find themselves in. Being able to live an active lifestyle, it means that they're able to move when they're uncomfortable and therefore be pain-free. It means that they're able to breathe more easily and digest their food. And all of these, they've got significant impacts on the quality of life that these children are living at the end of the day. Disability is not something you can welcome into your life every day. Some days you need to fight it and push against it. And the equipment you have to use cannot become the enemy. It has to be the friend. <laughs>